This young lady is filled with regret. However, it's over her family's choice of a place of worship. They are members of Westboro Baptist, which some say is more known for its protests than its preaching of the gospel. Les Trent with the story of a young woman banished from the church and her family. Your army keeps marching to hell. They are messengers of hate. The Westboro Baptist Church has become infamous for callously picketing the funerals of American soldiers killed in combat. Shamefully, they even threatened to picket funerals following the massacre at Newtown, Connecticut. But just who are these people who have become notorious for their outlandish behavior? I was so ashamed. I, I wanted to hide my face. Now for the first time, we are hearing from an insider. Lauren Drain has been banished from the church and disowned by her family for speaking out. She says she was sucked in when she turned 14 and her father joined the church. Do you believe that you were ever brainwashed? I think I was brainwashed in this cult, definitely. Lauren found herself carrying signs like, don't pray for the USA at the funerals of our fallen soldiers. But she says she knew it was wrong even then. I prayed that nobody would see me at the picket, knowing that that was such a shameful thing that I was doing. Most Americans find the protests offensive, but in 2011, the Supreme Court upheld the church's right to stage them. That decision caused widespread outrage. I'm no lawyer, but I know enough about our Constitution to know it is based on the premise of fairness. What these people are doing is not just unfair, it is wrong. When Lauren questioned the church's teaching and wanted to date outside the church, she says she was placed under house arrest for a month and then banished. She was 21. It wasn't until afterwards I realized how much harm and destruction I had done to other families and how awful that was. Together we looked at the video of the protests and, and Lauren is, spotted a familiar that. face. Yep. That's Bags my sister. Or beasts. That's your sister? Mm -hmm. When's the last time you saw her? Five years ago. What is it like for you to see your sister here? She's so intelligent. She's such a sweet girl and I hate to see her that this is all that can become of her. Lauren tells the story of her seven years inside the church in a new book, Banished, Surviving My Years in the Westboro Baptist Church. The church claims its lies. She is now rebuilding a life outside the church, works as a cardiac nurse, and is engaged to her boyfriend, David. But she says she still misses her family and has this plea. I'm pleading with my family to leave, to stop, you know? And I'm still trying to tell them there's hope. If you'd like to read an excerpt from Lauren's book, just come to our website, InsideEdition.com.